Hello and welcome back to Terraria. How are you doing? I am, it's gonna, I am gonna need time to get used to saying that one, I gotta say. I never, I never really thought I'd uh, put this on my itinerary. Is that the right word? Probably not. But, uh, you know, we're making, we're making some progress. Um, it's gonna be a little bit of a, I, I'm kind of surrounded on both sides by bad things, so um, it's not going to be great for a while. Right, we have, we do have our, um, we do have a, a, a grappling hook though, so that's good. We got a very early grappling hook. That's, that's definitely going to, um, quicken our, you know, our exploration, our ability to explore. I know you can kind of get rid of spider biomes. There's a way to do it. I can't remember what it is, but... There's a way to get rid of it. We, we're gonna want this, the cobwebs for something. I can't. I, I think it's um, mostly it's it's a bed. Uh, my cat just insisted on sitting down on me and now has left in a hurry. So that's nice. I can't remember. Is this a um, this is a pretty good grappling hook and it's also a grappling hook with two. Oh, three. Wow. Wow, four? How many does how many do we get? Five? Six? Oh my god. Yo, we just like okay, so there is a limit. Eight. That kind of makes sense, I guess. Um, you know, eight a spider, eight eight legs. We get we get eight grappling oh god, spider. I do hate the spiders in this game. They're they're very creepy. We don't have enough knockback to like, fully knock them back. Okay. So we're gonna move down here. There was- Oh, the spiders were underwater, though. Um, we are gonna wanna... <laughs> get down there and find some stuff. I don't know. It, it, a lot of, um, a lot of Terraria is, is looking for a lot of accessories and stuff. We're gonna wanna put our money away. I should've put our money away in the beginning, but... Oh, well. You know, mistakes were made. Fortunately, we've got a little, um, you know, there's a pond at the bottom here. What's, oh, there's spiders underwater. Stop it. Okay, well that's gonna, unfortunately... You know what I want to do, actually, is I want to create a little bit of a... Oh, hold on. I want to I wanna create a, 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 almost like a, uh, fjord? Not a fjord. There's a way of putting it, like, almost like a dock. But I want, I don't want all of the water to disappear. I think it, whoa, is that a, there's a spooky ghost. You know, it is a spooky month. It is a spooky month. Oh, you know what? Maybe the uh, number of gravestones is actually starting to turn this area into a, um, a, a, a graveyard biome. That is a, something you, you actually have to kind of do if you want to achieve everything. I guess we don't really need the water anymore since we have, oh. Well, I didn't, I didn't press it quickly enough, but we, we have our, our grappling hook that's gonna allow us to stop us from death by, by falling. Um, okay, maybe we, do we have some, oh, we have more rope. I'm still pressing tab when what I mean to do is hit escape. Oh, we don't need platforms. I keep thinking we don't have a, a, a grappling hook, but we totally do. We, oh! Okay. Alright. Well. You could just do that, I suppose. That was pretty good. That was, uh, a explosion trap. There is a seed you can use that, uh, makes, makes it so that there are no traps ever. Tempting. Very tempting, but no, I, I'm not gonna do that. I figured the game was already gonna be too easy in a way. Um, not for me. It's not that it was gonna be too easy for me. It was gonna be too easy f to watch. Like, I figure that the people who actually enjoy Terraria are like, yo, I've beaten this game on hardcore mode, you know, like, with no deaths and whatever. And like, you know, why Why would I? This is, this is hardly the MLG experience that I wanna watch. Which, you know, you truly are in the wrong place. There's plenty of channels that are doing Terraria better than I could. 
Um, you know, I'm just trying my best. I'm not, not, not doing the best. I'm just trying my best. So, um, probably for some, it's not going to be as entertaining, but, you know, hopefully there's something. There's some kind of entertainment value here. I'd like to think that there is. Finding a lot of copper. I don't necessarily need any more copper. We've pretty much got as much copper as we're ever going to need. I don't know what the point is, honestly, of having any copper. What is that? Giant sc scully? Shelly. I think this is for dye. No, it's just a it's just a weird monster. That's it. Really. Archery potion. Oh, there's a there's a little thing here. There's some um that's silt. Silt is actually useful a bit later. We don't have the means to make it useful yet. There's a machine you can you can uh, basically convert silt and I think ash. Can't remember if it's silt and ash into oh no it's slush, silt and slush into um, basically just random junk. Debatably worth it. Um, here's the the the, the miner's. Uh, helmet is really coming in handy here Yo, where did that uh, glow stick come from? Did I do I have a oh my god, oh I do have glow sticks. I don't know where I got them from Glow sticks are useful for me anyway because um, you know when I'm digging down in a straight line which I do you know, tend to do. What do you mean, achievement completed? Hey, listen. Hello? I, I just got an achievement. Are you gonna show me something? I'm gonna drown. There's a chest. Let's get some air. Let's, let's not drown. I did just get an achievement. It was a very loud sound. Signifying an achievement, but hey, there's a there's an, a, a chest over there. So Definitely, that's why we're down here looking forward to getting some of the crazy mining uh, Pickaxes and stuff that just blow through the ground. What do we got? Oh, we got sapphires. I'll be we could sell those um, Cloud in a bottle that'll be our first accessory, which is nice Uh I always, I always think it's a good practice to get rid of chests after you've um, looted them. I know I've already not done that, but I'm going to do that here and then also. Oh, I see, I see you, Mr. Boulder. That boulder is re really ready to kill me. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to probably... Oh, there, there it is. I never know how to like safely get rid of boulders without dying. Let's just buy a bunch of ropes. If we, if I see that the, I can't place any more ropes, then we've reached the bottom, and then I'm gonna have to continue my my little hole. This will be, we'll be do, doing this all the way down to the underworld. Okay, so we've we've used up all of our ropes. Um, I'm gonna sell these traps. These traps are actually worth quite a, a nice chunk of money. Uh, we can sell our the gravestone, even though it's not worth anything. I guess I can sell copper. I won't sell lead. Lead'll be worthwhile. Hey, my dude, who who refuses to close the door? And I'm gonna buy as many ropes as I can. Okay, so this this should be enough to get to the bottom to to the underworld, basically. All right, certainly it's enough to get to the bottom of whatever we've got. Oh, all right, this is gonna be kind of a problem. I, I hate these spiders. They have zero knockback, so they, they, you know, they can't, they're not bothered. They are seriously not bothered by the fact that we have um, a decent weapon. Yeah, I mean, I, I might do a cut here because I'm, I'm pretty much doing this for a little bit. Ooh, all right, we've got a chest under here. Hopefully I won't die to these skeletons. I've also got a trap. Not, not hugely grateful about that, but it's okay. Might just do a, a, a run, hit and run on that chest over here. Oh! 
Well, I just got another achievement that I've never gotten before. Dead men tail no tails. Brutal. Ah, I haven't died to so many traps in such a short amount of time. Okay, well, is there anything good in here? Spiked shoes, dead man's dead man sweater. I think we're we're at mushrooms as well. I gotta get started on the on the farm. The um, cloud in the bottle gives you a double jump, which is nice. Um, but it's not gonna be it, it's gonna be pretty redundant later when we we have the ability to fly and stuff So we can combine it though. It will be something we can combine basically all of our nice accessories into like super accessories All right, there's quite a lot of that tungsten and I'm pretty much pr Well, there's a boulder there ready to kill me so we're probably gonna die to that boulder somehow, but I, I do just want to continue working on this. Um, I guess it I usually I guess they refer to it as uh, elevators, or at least I've referred to them as elevators. I don't know if that's the common uh, term for these, but um, you know it just means a a long tunnel channel straight to hell. Um, yeah, I was slow there. I was trying to I was trying to juggle a few, couple things there. That's okay. We'll get our money back. Let's, uh, we're gonna use up these ropes. Because, uh, when we, we've continued this... Unfortunately, it's... We haven't continued it that much. Because there's a, there's a wall on the way. So let's go take care of that wall. Yeah. Oh, wait, what? Oh, it's, um... A little bit of, a uh, webbing. That's what it was. I, I really appreciate some of the... The quality of life features in Terraria don't miss, ever. They're really nice. And there's generally quite a lot of quality of life features in every single Terraria update. There's still more that could be added, and there's quite a lot of mods that do that. Yeah, they, you know, the modding community for for Terraria is pretty, pretty, pretty big, and um, I, I wouldn't mind doing a playthrough of Terraria with mods. But I figured we wanted to, you know, we wanted to get the 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 vanilla experience first what is happening right here this is not really what you want to see uh I'm, I'm gonna die again for sure i'm trying desperately to balance like three things this ghost is a problem oxygen please okay i wanted to i wanted whatever was in there is that just copper? If it's just copper, I'm gonna be a little bit cheesed. I think it's rubies. This is probably just co it's just copper. Oh my god. Alright, fine. Alright, there's something in here. Probably just ropes and stuff. No no chests. We need we need to find a bunch more chests. And gold, honestly, would be nice. This is just copper, yeah. I wish I could explore the world a little bit more. The desert on the left and corruption to our immediate right is is uh, very much hampering our ability to explore. Ooh, this could be good. What is this? There's nothing in here. Well, okay, there's some lead. Lead is actually pretty good. Lead is the our equivalent to iron. I forgot we had double jump already. <laughs> I'm, like forgetting that we have like very basic and, and important things. And double jump basically means we don't ever have to take falling damage again. We don't have to do some tricky grappling stuff either. I am gonna collect the silt at some point. Oh, is this another spider's den? I really kind of hope not. What is that over there? There's something casting light over there. It's probably a skeleton with a miner's helmet. Which you can, you can get a free miner's helmet. I think I already said that. Ooh, another crystal. Yeah, there it is. Oh, ow. Some amethyst here. I definitely want the amethyst. We we still wouldn't mind getting a free uh, miner's helmet because they're worth quite a bit of money. We got a hook instead. We don't really need the hook. I know the amethyst is good for um, making that basically a, a starting wand. Not that that's super helpful, but um, magic isn't gonna be very good for quite a long time because we, we only start with like one 
mana. <laughs> and so, you know, every spell basically soaks you dry right away. Ooh, okay, here we go. This is nice. Kind of want that painting. Hermes boots. Excellent. We definitely want Hermes boots. And a Spelunker's potion is actually kind of a big deal as well. Where, rare, what? Rare enchantment. Crowno the devourer? Crowno devours his lunch, okay. Fun little paintings. We'll, we'll put those up in the in our headquarters. Definitely interested to, to hear what people think of my my method for for building a crappy headquarters for the all of the NPCs. I don't think that it's probably an uncommon strat. There's a lot of stuff going on down here, but at least we're getting to, to actually explore and uh, collect some stuff. Is that some more amethyst? Yes, it is. What is that? Emerald. Nice. Oh, some gold. Gold pickaxe would also be really good. Not sure if that shouldn't be our first thing. Oh, we got a sunken chest. Breathing reed. Not not the best find, but we did get some gold, so that's nice. Um, do we have? A, we do actually have a couple of recall potions, so we don't have to die to get back home. Was that more gold? Oh, that's a nice chunk of gold right there. All right. So that's pretty much that cavern explored fully. There's some tungsten. Ooh. Oh, this is, this is the underground sand cavern. Oh, ow, ow, oh, why did I walk right in lava? Oh, that was stupid. Is that gold there? I kind of want that gold. Ooh, that's a nice chunk of gold. Oh. The uh, the sand falling and, and hurting us is gonna is, is is a big suck. Okay, what I'd like is to get the rest of that gold and oh no, don't fall in the lava. I love uh, I love this this grappling hook with like a bajillion hooks. It's a really nice first get, honestly. Okay, let's get this gold and then I'm gonna recall. Nice. Um. So I think what I want to do is I'm going to take a second here to imp minorly improve things for um, this this our headquarters. I, I want to um, maybe move our, our our NPCs to the second floor and then have this first floor be like crafting and then have dig out a basement for storage. So I'm going to do that real quick. I guess uh, before I do that, I'm gonna I'm gonna make some better tools. So we'll bear bear with me. What is this web rope? Plus three range can be placed material for something else. Cool. Okay. Um, all right. Let's see here. We want gold bar. Oh, look at that. We can already make a gold broadsword. Where did we get like just gold stuff? Gold bars. All right, we got a nice chunk of gold. We definitely want a pickaxe. I'm just going to trash that copper one. Sorry. Um, and I'm going to make some greaves. And again, I'm just going to trash copper stuff. I like I know you can you can be very um, like keep your old armor so you can like put it on display. Uh, I might just like remake copper in the future because it'll be a non-problem. Um, but uh, you know, I don't I don't want to like have to keep my armor and like you know store it somewhere and it's just it's just not worth it. I've done it. I've done that before quite a bit. And it's just not worth it to me. Is that that's tungsten and then we have lead. I'm not sure what the tungsten. So the tungsten is iron. The uh, sorry, the lead is iron. And the tungsten is silver. Basically, that's what they uh, what they take place. We have a heavy workbench used for advanced crafting. We definitely want that. So let me let me take a moment to um, kind of properly sort out our house a bit.
We got ourselves a star. This will be helpful. Um, honestly, it wouldn't be at this early in the stage. It wouldn't be a bad idea to kill a few zombies for for the extra money and also glow sticks and stuff like that. Like I say, I'm not gonna go like crazy with uh, with organization. Unfortunately, I know people would prefer I do probably throw that stuff in there put like equipment and stuff in here mud blocks this is going to be my my seed and uh, mud block chest I'm gonna throw basically all materials that are used for potions you know what let's throw some potions in there as well and then over here we're going to put monster stuff I guess I said I wasn't going to organize and now I'm organizing and um I do so what I want to do is uh I'll prep these ne these other um, houses to actually be proper, like, living conditions. And, uh, and then I'll move our, our NPCs in there. Uh, I do want to make that wand. I'm not sure what we need for the wand. Let me, let me ask them, the, the guide. I remember a time where the guide was actually, like, worthless, and now they're, like, invaluable, at least to me. We need, oh my god, we actually need copper. I cannot believe it, but I, I want to maybe build things up a bit. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, we'll, we'll chop down a couple of trees, and um, I don't know. Oh, what is, what was that? Eucalyptus sap. There's some new stuff in this game. Summons a pet sugar glider. Fun. So we have a pet sugar glider. Huh. I don't know if it's gonna like do anything for us. Like you know, some some pets will uh like fight for you what is what is this camera mode oh i didn't mean to do that at all well at least the um, oh this might be one of those pets that just like hangs around doesn't actually like it's not like one of those summons that actually like does damage but that's still good nice we got a we got a pet and it was a, it's a sugar glider i have mixed feelings about um that in a way i think that um Sugar gliders are one of those endangered pets you're not actually allowed to have. And I always feel, have, like, kind of gross feelings whenever I see people, or like, TikToks or stuff with people with sugar gliders. It's like, you're, that's not, not really a pet. <laughs> like, it's a wild animal that you have thrown in your house. Like, cats are pets at this point. They're, they're very much, um, you know, we've, 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 not quite tamed cats you know dogs they're they're tamed they're pets at this point sugar gliders not so much and uh you know the a lot of the um environment created um basically incentivize when when you keep a pet like that is not great not great for the actual animal <laughs> sorry to make it real but uh you know i i feel this is the, these are the feelings I get when I when I see stuff like that. But it's a nice pet in the game, I suppose. Um, so this is a desert corrupted corruption. Kind of now that we have the Hermes boots and we have uh, the ability to move fairly quickly, uh, I would like to kind of try and get past this corruption. See if we can't get some accessories. This is probably something I should have reserved for the next episode. Anti knockback would be great one of the most important things as far as I'm concerned. Got a rotten chunk for one we want to summon. I think it's the Eye of Cthulhu. Got a ang aglet. And some copper bars. Look at that. Probably not enough to make the wand, but still. We've got a, a lot more health. I've actually collected quite a few life crystals on this episode. Just want to get um, through this area so we can, we can see what awaits us on the other side. And also, I, I do need to check what side of the world our dungeon is on. I, I want that marigold. Okay. Okay, so we've got our, our snow biome on this side. You can get some really good wood um, from the snow biome. These trees make an exceptionally pleasant to look at wood. Someone out there. Like, oh. I'm gonna talk about the ethics of uh, keeping sugar gliders as a pet, but what about cutting down trees? Listen here, buddy. Herb bag, right click to open. Oh, nice. Ooh. The, the balloon, balloon slime almost got me. 
Let's check out. There's sometimes there's some stuff down here, including uh, a living loom, uh, leaf wand. Maybe not like really exceptionally important stuff, but uh, you know, worth collecting all the same. Boomerang. I could turn that into a magic boomerang. Yeah, we're gonna need quite a lot of money in the future. There's a, a lot of stuff we need that costs quite a lot of money, including like just like re um, setting our weapons and stuff when we find the goblin. Finding the goblin is gonna be one of those things that might take us, it really is an indeterminable amount of time. It could take us no time at all, and it could be a while. I've had uh, playthroughs where I don't find the goblin until basically almost hard mode. Um, like after you've defeated the wall of flesh. Some people know what I'm talking about, some eh, you know, some people don't. Wow, wall, wall climbing is actually an unexpectedly nice treat when uh, you're trying to get up a column like this. <clears throat> I do just want to like get to the very rightmost side here and then maybe call it there for the episode. Okay, so we've got our dungeon is on the right side here. Good to know. Um, how much money do we have on us? Oh, quite a bit. Okay, I actually I forgot to store our money. All right, let's. Uh, we got. Wait, for some reason, we have a ton of recall potions. Let's just recall and then store our stuff. And I'm gonna I'm gonna call it here, and I'll do a bit of organizing between this and the next episode, so you don't have to watch that. Um, I hope you're enjoying the series. If you are, hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.